All right, what's up, Packet people? Welcome back to the channel. Today, I wanna to talk to you about how to filter for multiple ports with TCP. It used to be that you would set the syntax a certain way, which I showed on some of my previous videos, but now I wanna make sure that we're clear on how to set it today, Wireshark 4.0 or better. So let's get to it. So this is a PCAP that you can download. I just put the link in the description down below. You can download and follow right along. What I wanna do is come in here and I just wanna set a filter for several different TCP ports. Now, one way that we could do this is we could say TCP port equals equals 80, great, wonderful. But what if I also want secure web? Okay, so that's just regular web traffic or port 80 traffic with TCP. But if I wanna add another port, one way I could do that is I could say or tcp.port equals equals and then whatever else, 443. Now, if I have several ports that I wanna look for, this is where I might wanna use a special operator in Wireshark called the membership operator. Okay, let me show you how that works. So instead of equals equals, and then a bunch of values, so this field equals this value, this field equals this value. Instead of doing that, if I ever find that I'm repeating myself several times with a field, what I can do is just say tcp.port and then in. That activates the membership operator. Now, if I come over here, I'm just gonna do a curly brace and what I'm gonna do, historically, we just gave it a list of numbers that are space separated, or we could have used it a comma. Either one would work. But in some of my other videos, you would see me go 80, 8,000, for example, and close curly brace. Well now, from 4.0 and newer, we gotta add a comma there, okay? So when we add a comma between those values, now we're gonna see that filter description there turn green, and now we can apply this filter. Now something else that I like to do from time to time here, I wanna see all web, so I wanna see port 80, 443, but how about all 8,000? So dot dot, this is where I can say 8,000 to 8999, close curly brace. Now this is gonna give me any port in any of that range. So 80, 443, 8,000, all the way up to 8999. Now not all those ports are gonna be web, but find a lot of times 8080, 8001, 8002, 8004, 8443. A lot of times that encompasses a lot of the web traffic. So this might be a catch-all display filter to let me filter on any one of those ports. So I just wanna clear that up in this video. Hope this is useful to you and I'll see you again on another video.